Hey guys, it's FIFA Rally here and welcome to episode 4 of the ultimate skill quest and the featured skiller of this episode is Shifty and uh, I asked you guys who I should get in around him in this episode and there was a lot of shouts for Kalahan Nuklu, um, the Turkish player from the Bundesliga with 4 star skills, 5 star weak foot and pretty good free kick stats and he only cost me 900 coins and there was also quite a few shouts for Uchan from Roma, 5 star weak foot and 4 star skills on him as well and he would link nicely up with Strodman who I already had in my club and then I picked up a few other Turkish players which also were mentioned in some of the comments so picking up the players for the squad cost me a little bit less than 8,000 coins leaving me with 110,000 coins um, before I went into my games of this episode and my first opponent played with a sweat squad at least it was called that five at the back Syria team and uh, we got our first chance with Bataka here in the 10th minute going with a few skill moves here and eventually bring on through into the box trying out a shot but it was blocked I headed back into the box over at flick past one defender but unfortunately there was another one to head it away and then 39th minute Kala Nuklu with the very good free kick stats they're like 86 87 rated stats and he scores with an under the wall free kick a little bit lucky it hit a player and bounced away from the goalkeeper but it gave me the lead and it was a nice goal in my opinion so it gave us a 5,000 coins and uh, into the second half we got yet another free kick and Calo Nuclear would step up forward yet again 20, 28 yards out and he scores again to make it 2-0. Two goals from him in this match. Lovely curve free kick this time around. And uh, pretty much straight after this goal, my opponent, he decided he decided to pause the game and quit. So we got a rate quit as well, giving us yet, uh, yet another coin bonus in 7,500 coins. And I jumped right into my next game and I faced a bit of a Serie A team again. And then I think there was two, three La Liga players into the side as well for some reason, which didn't really have the perfect chemistry. It was Chifty with the first chance here, breaking on into the box. And I should not have gone with the chip there. Way too easy to save for the keeper. I needed more power on that, but on the weak foot, it didn't really turn out too great. But uh, we kept on creating chances. But Taka on the ball here into the box past several players eventually takes the shot was blocked off by the defender unfortunately could have been a very very nice goal that one but uh, we continued on with Butaka here as we start the second half on the wing beats a few players goes into the box and we get a little bit lucky to get it over the line and if the defender had not hit the ball I'd probably counter that as an awesome goal but because he got a bit of a touch to it I decided to count it as a nice goal giving us 5,000 coins and then finally we got our first goal with Shifty there a few skill moves and a cheeky little finish before my keeper decided to do his own little thing and he was nowhere near my goal when my opponent took the shot lucky for me it went over, but Sillison sometimes he does some weird stuff in my opinion, and that time it almost cost me a goal. Uh, but uh, we still had that two goal lead. Again, I tried for that chip, but I don't know why. I, I wanted to score a chip, but I just took the chip shots from the most stupid positions uh, in this episode. So I didn't score from it, and in the end, the game would end at a 2 to nil. Yet another little comfortable victory. Uh, Butaka and Shifty each with a goal. And uh, for our third match of the episode, we would yet again face a five in the back formation. Uh, pretty much a full well side apart from uh, Boyan on the top there. And it's Uchan with the first chance, trying out a volley but saved by the keeper. And then it's Butaka on the ball, continuing with his skill moves. Beats two players out in the wing, takes on another one and one more before he beats a fourth or fifth defender and tucks it over the line to score an awesome skill goal and bring us up 1-0. In the 41st minute, we picked up a penalty. Decide to go for the little chip down the middle, but right on the key. But I just want to score that little Panenka penalty. But the downside to it is you can see it when you run up forward. Like the run up is just so obvious you're going to chip it. And that meant he would save it. Again, me trying out a chip and failing it before I picked up yet another penalty in this match. And this time around, I decided not to go for the chip. Uh, I think it will be what I'll try to do uh, in a game. First time I get a penalty, I'll probably try, try for the chip, and if I miss it, I'll go for a reckless shot. And it was good I got that second goal, because my opponent got a goal back to make it 2-1, put the pressure on me, and in the 19th minute, I managed to clear it away, but not far enough, and he would pick it up here, and for some reason, he passed it to his keeper, who went up on the corner, he went with a fake shot and tried to run on through. Bad idea, I got the ball, passed it to Uchan, and I just launched that with a 
long pass from my own half into the back of the net. It was it would roll over the line and make it a 3-1. And that would see my opponent rage quit. For some reason, he quit in the 19th minute, which in my opinion is a little bit stupid. But um, nonetheless, yet another win for us with the Turkish and Dutch squad. And uh, yeah, my, my fourth opponent would have a really strong Premier League 4 triple two squad. And uh, it would be Chifty to create the first chance of the match into the box here. We try out the shot. And this was perhaps one spot where I could have chipped it from. Because next time I got a chance with Chifty, I was thinking uh, I was in sort of a similar spot. And I tried for the chip. And this time around, I should probably have finessed it. I just messed up my chances. But nonetheless, my opponent decided to rate squid with out me even scoring a goal, which I found really weird, but um, yeah, it gave us 7,500 coins for the rage quit, and for my final game of the episode, it was probably my toughest opponent of them all, 4-3-3, the false night formation, uh, a bit of a BPL Bundesliga side, and he was definitely a strong opponent, I struggled creating stuff against him, but I got a penalty here, and again, I wanted to go for the chip down the middle, and again, you can see it on the run-up, and he saved it easily. To deny me the goal, unfortunately. I got a free kick, but every time I got a free kick in this match, he just puts play, put players on the line. This was this was my best one. It hit the crossbar, but no goal. And instead, he would pass it across, and I, I think my defender was actually covering that, but Sillison gave him the ball on the rebound, and he could make it a 1-0. But then Shifty showing up, 87th minute, to get me a goal back, and make it a 1-1, and then it was Uchan to finish it all off in extra time. Very similar to Chifty's goal to make it 2-1, win me the game. And we managed to go unbeaten with the squad, which was pretty nice. It played really well, in my opinion. Um, Chifty was an alright skiller. I still feel he's a little bit bit clumsy on the ball at times. Kala Nuklu was probably my favorite player. His free kicks were extremely good. Four star skills and that five star weak foot. And Uchan, uh, he is a center mid by default, but playing him as a striker actually worked out tried all right in my opinion those are sort of the three standout players but anyways guys this is going to be the end of the episode i hope you guys did enjoy it and that is pretty much all i'll talk to you later